All right, what's good, YouTube? So, hey, y'all seen that thumbnail? Y'all seen the title? It's another tutorial video. I know y'all like these, so I'm gonna keep them coming. So today, I'm gonna give y'all a chess tutorial. And this one is something I got from Bradley Martin. Uh, check out his YouTube channel. I always give respect to whoever I learn these exercises from or get the ideas from, but this one's gonna really help you hit that upper chest. Now, this is an elite movement, so it might take you a while to really get this technique down and to really feel it. Uh, work your chest in the way it's supposed to work your chest, but let's get into it. That's enough talking. So, um, you can do this. So, for my gym, we don't have like a squat rack or something like that where I can have a free weight bar. Um, to do this exercise free weighted, so we're gonna do it on the Smith machine. Um, so basically all you wanna do is have a straight bar, barbell, Smith machine, whatever it may be, and then you wanna have a bench. And the thing with the bench, you're basically gonna put it um, in an upright position. So about right there, that's good. Move this back a little bit. And then what you'll see is that Maybe. You know what? We're not going to use this bench because it's too tall to actually do what I want it to do. So we're going to move this out of the way and use the other one. It always takes a minute to get this just right because it's a Smith machine and it's stuck in place. But we're gonna make it work. So, so from this position, you'll see that it looks like you know we're about to do like some shoulder presses. But what you're gonna do is you're actually going to stick your chest up and stick your back. On the, um, on the chair like this, so kind of arch your back. Um, so yeah, so you'll come down, and where you want to target at is like right at your upper chest, like almost right at your clavicle, right? And you're gonna hit just right here. So what you're doing by, you're hitting your chest, and then this exercise is designed to hit your chest muscle, not your shoulders. So you want to make sure you keep your shoulders rotated back. You want to keep those all the way back and not have them hunch forward. So keep them back and then up right here. So you let it stretch, 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 up, stretch. So really this exercise is almost super close to doing an incline uh, bench press but um, not at like a 45 degree angle or not even like at a 60 degree angle. It's like basically at a 90 degree angle and you're sticking your chest up to get the work. So you're really hitting that, that upper chest. This is a really good way. I would do this exercise, you know, maybe at the end of your workout, maybe before your, you know, your final exercise, maybe you can superset this with push-ups or something like that, but do this at the end of your exercise to really cap off that, that upper chest and get that work up there. You know, if you're struggling or lagging with your upper chest, like I am, this can be a really good exercise to really help um, build that up, you know? So, all right, I'm gonna put some weight on here so y'all can see a little bit more. So again, this is also another exercise, you know, you don't have to go super fast with, you know, just a simple tempo, um, you know, one, two count is all you really need. But all you want to do is remember that this is not a shoulder exercise, it's your chest. So it's going to take a lot of mind-muscle connection. This is an elite exercise. So 
Be careful when doing it. You don't want to have your shoulders hunched over. You can really put them in a compromised position. So just be mindful. Again, consult your dog. Again, consult your doctor before attempting any of these exercises. I am not a physical trainer. I'm not certified or nothing like that. Try this at your own risk. I am a trained professional. Notice how I'm slow and controlled. I'm not slamming the weight down on my chest. I'm just simply touching it and exploding up. And by going slow, I'm really allowing my chest to really stretch and then squeeze. Stretch, squeeze, stretch, squeeze. Boom. All right, y'all, so I hope y'all really like that exercise. Again, I got that one from Bradley Martin really good way to hit that upper chest and get it nice and right. So if you're lagging in that body part, try that exercise out for yourself. Let me know what you think. Let me know what other exercises or tips and tricks, like gyms in terms of exercises that y'all want me to go over for y'all. Um, but don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, and I'm gonna holla at y'all.